Hello everyone, it's Amy, and I am just here to show you um, a junk journal that I made. Yesterday morning, I saw Shannon Green. Um, is, she had a live stream, I think, on Sunday, um, which I didn't see, but, but I did see the video yesterday morning. And I just loved what she was doing, and as soon as I saw her come out, I just grabbed some things together and decided to join in with her. And this is what I made. And um, she made hers with all junk mail. Well, my junk mail was at Papa's house and the door was closed and I didn't want to wake him up because it was early in the morning and I wanted to play. So I just went ahead and went into my paper drawer and I just pulled out a bunch of junk paper, just a bunch of white. It was all white copy paper, things I had cut pieces out of or I drew something on it and didn't like it and just threw it in there for, you know, scratch off paper or whatever. And so I just grabbed out a bunch of pieces of those. This is my cover, and I did it like she did. I just put a bunch of colors in the back, and then I um, used a stencil in black, and then I used a different stencil in white. And so this is what it looked like. And she doodled on hers. I didn't get a chance yet to doodle on mine. But, um, so this is my cover. And then all of my papers were all different shapes and sizes. And so I, and what I did was I have a stapler that reaches long. She sewed her spine together, but I was lazy and I just stapled mine. So, and so after I did the cover, then I did the center. And so this is the center. And the center is actually a U-shaped piece of paper and that I had cut a square out of the middle of it for some reason. So. I, I just opened it up to the center and I did the whole page that way. But the way that that worked out then is, is that part of that is on this page because, because it only had this much on the side. And then I have another part there. I guess I'm not quite, there we go. And still showing through. And then I have that with still a little bit showing through. And then this is actually my first page. So the way that I did it was after I did the center page, then I just started filling in whatever was left white. So after the center page, when I turned the page, all of this was white, but this was still colored. So I covered this with a piece of paper to mask it off and painted all the rest of the white orange. And then I turned the page and here, this section here was still white, and so I did this section by masking off all the rest, and then turned the page, and the only thing left that was white was just here, so I masked off everything else and painted there. And so, and then this one, I did the whole page like this, and then, because this is a half a page that goes through to the other side, I opened that up and only this was still white, and so I masked this off and, and did this part. So that's how I did it. I had really fun. Totally confused Grandpa with all the different colors. Every time I turned the page, everything kept changing, and yet part of it was staying the same. So, and it is a little bit confusing. I had fun doing it. Um, it was just a blast. But it, I don't think I would do that many shapes again. I did start another one after I finished this one. And um, that one I just did the straight shapes and this shape. And I'm just actually starting that. But I love the way that this looks. Ow. You know, I shouldn't cook because I never cut myself hardly when I'm when I'm crafting. Well, that's not true. But yesterday I made a pie, uh, a chicken pot pie, and when I was folding the aluminum foil to put it around the crust, I ran my hands down it to flatten it out and I cut my finger. So see, I shouldn't cook, I should just craft. But anyway, sorry about that. I love the way that this whole page is all like one color and then you open it up and you've got that center. So I decided to do my next one like that so it wasn't as busy and in so much there. So this is my cover of my second one. This was just so much fun and you should watch Shannon Green's. It was good to see her back. So you should watch her video. And then I did this whole page, and then I did, you know, because this was folded over, it didn't get painted here, and it didn't get painted here, so then I opened it up and masked that off and painted the center. 
So that's as far as I have on this one. So the next page is is got the little short one. And I haven't decided if I'm going to open it up and do it this way or if I'm going to do it this way. I think I'm going to open it up and do it this way and then go back in and this piece and this piece will be another color and so will that. But And then I have the other half of the first page there. So And I did make this one shorter because I think that it took me five hours to finish this one. But I was having such fun playing with it, I didn't want to put it aside because I tend to put things aside and then I never get them back out again. Because I start something else so but thank you anyways for watching go ahead and go check out Shannon Green's um, video on that so she explains the whole thing she does the whole thing um, well she does one um, page like in front of you shows you how to put it together and she does a page and um, and it's a really cool video so and if you feel like arting along it's a perfect video it's it's a nice long video where you can get your stuff out and you can listen to her chat you know watch what she's doing and you can just do it yourself thank you very much for stopping by to see what I'm up to and I hope that you all have an outstanding day bye bye